some hot tea. Did he throw something? What was what was Candace Are you kidding? Owens views on You're a fucking Twitter idiot. Again. You're real tough, bro. Socialism. I, I really? Really? I was not. I'm sure. Are you kidding? We were not meaning to attack really? You're tough, bro. You're tough, bro. You're tough as fuck, bro. Call the cops, please. Trump lost the election. Everything must go. Trump lost. Everything must go. Yeah, we're giving this. Trump lost. Well, no, no, no. Trump lost. Because of. Trump lost. Be, because of obviously because of the election. The the, the election. The votes. No, no. Not actually, it is over. But you could still. But let me see what you're doing in there, Pam. Can I see? Pam, just let no. her go. Yeah. You gotta no, let her go. No, because you're gonna yell at me. I'm not gonna yell. Up. I swear to God, I will no, yell. You say this every time. No, just let her go. Just let her see. This is the her house. Her rule. Her house. Her house. So they know, so they know, so they know. It, okay, well, she, she said did. she did, but I didn't give it to her. My she mom gave her, she, the first check she got was forty eight dollars. Mm -hmm. Like her mom ain't gonna let her but know. She said it was a two day check. And then when, five the, hours. When, when the lady, listen, when my baby got her check, because we already knew what she was supposed to get anyway. I'm gonna show her how to add her money up. I don't know about nobody else, but I'm gonna teach man how this world go. But anyway, this young lady here, when she texted, first she called about three times. She don't answer the phone. Then she texted her. She said, Oh, that's a two day check. Two day check of five hours. But she never five hours. Five she hours. worked she worked a whole three weeks and you tell me you're gonna give my baby forty eight dollars? We ain't having none of that. Mm. So this young lady, then when I came up here, her son was here, she wasn't here because she was going through something, which I got sympathy for people, you know what I'm saying? But I really don't give a fuck about nothing. Jacob, she's mad pissed cause I didn't go at the yellow light. <laughs> Yo, I'm just fried as fuck trying to go to work, bro. <laughs> Take a picture of you. Take a picture with him. No. I'm taking a picture right here. Come on, no, braid my hair. No. Braid my hair. Go ahead. Don't touch his phone. Do like, keep it like that, and then. Okay, okay. keep it. Like, I'm gonna keep it like this. <laughs> oh. Oh. That's what you get. I'm to bag you. I don't even want to be in here. Stop dancing. I'm not laughing at <laughs> You got it, Jaquavia? Hey, I, I have I have confidence in you. Shut up. No. <laughs> Stop moving. Okay, go ahead. Stop touching me! Okay, I got you. Look, my hand's right here. I'm a rock. Put your hand down. Can we please get our coke that we paid for? We just want our pop. Can we get our coke? Are we going to hold up the line all night till we get our coke? We're going to hold up the line until we get our coke. Can you give us our pop? For. You in there talking about our gift card. You're in there talking about our gift card. Like, what's wrong with the gift card? I didn't say nothing until I heard you talking about our gift card. Hey, my man, I'm a grown ass man. Can we can just I get, get our coke? pop? My man, can I get my coke, get bro? Get my money back then. We just want our pop. Well, can I get my money back? Can I get my money back? Well, can I get my coke then? Okay. She's talking really negative. She's swearing. Take that coke out, man. Okay, let's start a story time about my Saudi friends in high school. True story. So I went to high school in Switzerland, Geneva, in a private school, which means we had a lot of uh, people from all over the globe and a lot of people that were rich. I was actually the poorest kid in school. Basically, I had three Saudi kids in my class with the last name Bin Laden. 
<laughs> Don't panic. Joke aside though, they were the nicest, kindest people I've ever met. We're actually good friends today still. Yes, a lot of people bullied them for that. Yes, a lot of people were rude to them for that. But they took it pretty well. Until the day the biggest, meanest motherfucker in school, fucking Andy. Fuck you, Andy. He started to pick on them. Like, actually, like, bully them in front of everybody. And what Ahmed did was the best thing ever. Ahmed just looked at Andy and said, It's okay. I sent a plane to your house. <laughs> It looks like snow, just like I predicted in my forecast from the studio. I'm not sure why I'm out here literally looking around. It looks like snow. You could just take a video of it snowing and show that. Why do I have to be here to describe snowfall? It's pretty self-explanatory. <laughs> Seems like the cold has got you in an icy mood yourself, Ryan. Okay, you know what, Shannon? I am in an icy mood, okay? Nice pun. By the way, all right, I was just standing out here for 20 minutes waiting for you guys to throw to me, and I was just, oh, doing some thinking. I spent $120,000 on a degree and four years in college to come out here and look around and describe what I see. I literally learned that in kindergarten, I spy. It makes zero sense. Also, you know what else I was We're or nowhere related. In my opinion, I think black people evolved from animals and i believe that we need to be separated whites and blacks need to be separated i don't agree with race mixing let them set up their own state where they belong and give them their own homeland and if your daughter when she got older came home and said i want to go out with a black boy i'd disown her wouldn't have nothing else to do with her for the rest of my life because of who she loved no it's not love if you if you love you love somebody of your own race who decreed that god decreed that Jesus decreed that. I thought Jesus said love each other. The Jesus said love your neighbor, but if you read the Bible. As yourself. Uh, you ready? Yeah. Cool, cool. Yeah, where's your mask? Um, I can't wear one, dude. I have like a medical condition. It makes it really hard to breathe. What is it? Ah, uh, COVID. Oh, hell no. Oh, you weird, bro. Did you tell your mom that school's for losers and it's not your responsibility to clean your room? That you have to clean your room. How many chances am I going to give you? Every time I give you a chance, you go back and do the same thing. Oh, you know what? Give me this. Yeah. This. Computers. Okay. There you go. You can keep that. And this is your phone. have the vibrational frequency to hold host that virus and I taught her that so if you if you don't have that vibra vibra vibrational frequency right here you're not gonna get it yeah I you we don't have the vibrational frequency to get COVID correct do you know that everything in this universe vibrates and is alive there is life with that that's what I'm talking about I don't put life into COVID I'm not gonna wear a mask I'm not gonna wear a mask, mask either they I never wear a mask we're not gonna wear them ever why didn't you fucking call me earlier, bitch? Damn. It ain't no fucking damn. You should have fucking caught me, you dumb bitch. You know, I was actually going. Fuck to you. 
Yo, watch his racist scene. I'm not sure. All right, back up. Sir, I'm just going to examine you for a second here. Oh, okay. Ew. We got a colostomy bag. Probably back it up. We're going to have to That shit, guys. That shit. Try to relax. These paramedics here are going to attend people. Oh, hell no. I knew it. See? You do it. He would have been racist to her. Now she'd be racist to her. I'm fine. Sir, you're not fine. Your bowel is probably obstructed. The contents here in a colostomy bag are backing up into your system. You're about to choke on your own waist. You will suffocate and die. Just let him die. Let him die. Okay, sir, if you refuse care, we cannot administer it by force. Oh, what about him? Diaz. Diaz. What kind of name is that? My father's from Mexico. My mother's Swedish. I can help you out with the Swedish half, but no one told me which half that is. Okay, would you like me to call you another paramedic team so you can have an all white one? Bruh. Question for men. What are you doing in the bathroom and why the fuck is it taking you that long to poop? As a council representative, I'd like to answer this question if it's okay with the rest of the council. Um, there's one of three things that happens when a man poops. The first one is... We just sit there and contemplate our life at that point. The poop is done, but the mind will wander too. The poop is big enough to where there might be some blood in there. And at that point, you're just fascinated and you forget about everything that's going on. Third, most important, is the never-ending wipe. It's where you wipe and you wipe and you wipe and it seems like it never stops. Then you think, am I gonna die? Why the fuck did you give me a ticket? <laughs> For what? For what? <laughs> no, refuse it. Refuse it. Don't touch me. That's a song. Sure, sure, call me. But don't touch me. Do not touch me. You do not have the right to touch me. You're on camera, you have right there, you're right there. You're on you touch me again, it turns into salt. You are, I'm not breaking any laws. No, I'm not. They're just gonna tell me to leave too. That's all they're gonna do. Don't touch me. Or, you, or I'll be calling on you. Don't touch me. Don't touch me or call them on you. Now you're charged with salt. Then I will be calling you. Okay. Okay.